Hi, welcome to Medi Wellness, the kitchen segment. Today we are going to prepare cow piece leaves, commonly known as kunde, bo, or lihubi. This is a delicacy in Africa. We prepare the leaves by plucking them off the stalks so that we can prepare to wash and cook. As you see, we finished and now we're preparing to wash. How, ma how many times you rinse your vegetables depends on many things. One could be the source of the vegetables. It could be very dirty. Maybe there's the soil. Maybe it has been harvested in the rains or harvested from irrigation farms, which are normally contaminated with effluents from the factories. But you can see our vegetable is not very dirty. As we pour out, you see, you can see some sun there, some evident dirt. And so we'll re wash again. Yes, making sure that it is clean. Pour out the water. You see, it's clean. So now we can decide either to chop the leaves or cook them as as whole ensure that whichever decision you do it's even on boiling you can just add one cup of water so, so that the food doesn't burn boiling just makes it a little bit easier when you're frying and just takes two minutes to be ready and that is if you've cooked on moderate heat see it's cooked now we want to fry. So what do we need? We need the boiled kunde, we have the tomatoes, the onion, and because I love spices, I have coriander, I have parsley, and I also have my milk, oil, and salt. Then, we, you, you can either chop your tomatoes or blend them. Then you have our onions, you have coriander and parsley, all of them chopped. And now it's time to fry. Heat the pan and add oil and fry your onions. You can use either bulb onions or spring onions, it's a matter of preference. I love browning, so brown it a little bit. And then you can add in your tomatoes. I didn't blend mine, so I'll have to ensure that it's cooked a little bit more to have them mashed. Try to make it into a paste and then add in your spices and add in your salt. Now mix them up to ensure that they are evenly mashed. Cover a bit for about two minutes. See, it's cooked. Now it's time to put in our, our kunde. So strain off excess water and add into the mixture and just fry. As we stir up, Let's learn a little bit about kunde. Kunde is a very nutritious vegetable. It's a plant protein that is rich in iron, calcium, phosphorus, zinc, and potassium, and vitamin C. Now see, after four minutes, our food is ready. The kunde looks nice. Some people eat it at this point, but for me, I love adding milk or fresh cream. See, it's nice. Kunde is delicious and is nutritious to both children and adults alike. Cook it a little bit more for one to two minutes and serve. I serve with ugali and meat. See, it's nice. Welcome. Thank you for watching. Like, share and subscribe.